Well, 2016. You had posted a pic of you and Erica Badu. I posted it? Yep. Okay. It was on your Twitter. Yeah. And now you guys are social media official at this point. When did you guys actually start dating? Because, because like I had mentioned, she was one of the voices in Black Dynamite. Yeah. Was it around that time? It was not too long after that. That's that's basically where we met, mm -hmm. you know. Um, yeah, she did she did some voices on the show, and um, and she, she I mean she did an amazing job, you know. And this is a, so crazy thing is so she went into the booth and she did her she did her lines, and she finished, and she was like, "You mind if, like I hang out or whatever?" Because she wanted to, you know, was, she was kind of liked the process and wanted to learn a little more. So I was like, "Cool." So Deborah Wilson came in after her and went in the booth. And Deborah shut it down. Like I don't know if you know Deborah Wilson, but she's like she's an, she's an, she's the best improv, one of the best improv actors I've ever seen. So she goes in the booth and she's just like, you know, she's going outside the lines and just doing her thing. And so Erica, so when Deborah finished, Erica was like, "Can I go back in and do my my little?" <laughs> and I think you know because she's got a little bit of a competitive nature too, right? So I was like, "Yeah, sure." So she goes back in and she kills it. I mean. She, I mean, everybody's in there just crying, like laughing. And and uh, so she comes out and I was just like, okay, we got to write her in some more episodes. I, Cause I didn't, I didn't know she was that funny. You know what I'm saying? I don't think a lot of people knew, know that she is as funny as she is. So we reached out to try to, you know, um, get it back in. No, actually, actually, no, I take that back. She actually reached out to us because she was trying to do um, a show herself, like some, like kind of like a one woman show. That she wanted to do, and and so we had talked about it. She wanted to see if there was any way I could I could help her. So we started talking about it, and and more I the more time I spent with her, the the more I saw how funny she was. And I mean like like Carol Burnett kind of funny. Like she goes into characters, and mm -hmm. you know I used to refer to her as like a female Richard Pryor, and I know that's a high regard, but like she. People don't know because she don't you know she's got a different kind of image for the public most yeah, of the time. She doesn't so, do a lot of interviews. Yeah. yeah. So um, so we started just developing this idea and through that we were talking every day and we and that was the thing I think we connected because we both had similar sense of humor. You know what I'm saying? So like, you know, it went from it went from, you know, one thing to the next eventually, like, you know, we were dating and, and we I think we, we were together for about four years. Okay. Were you married at the time? Did you guys start dating? So so here's the thing, right? <laughs> no, look. So we were we were separated. You know, um, but on paper, yes, we were. 